On today's video, we'll be dealing with a very common issue, and that's regarding the dishwasher. A lot of times I'll get calls and the tenant will basically tell me that their garbage disposal stinks. They've tried cleaning it, they put Clorox down there, and it's a temporary fix. And within a couple of days, even the next day, they'll have an issue where it'll start to smell like sewer is coming out of the garbage disposal. Now, what you want to do is when you're dealing with this type of problem is you want to understand that you have to find the source of the smell. If you're cleaning it, if you're just pouring Clorox, even plumbers will say don't use Clorox, use ammonia. But even when you're doing that, most plumbers who are experienced will tell you that the smell is coming because of a source. And the only way to eliminate it is to find the source of the smell. So what you want to do is you want to understand the setup for your garbage disposal. Now here I've removed the P-trap just to give you a better illustration or understanding. So you have basically two sources where the smell could be coming from. You have a drain line that comes from your dishwasher and then it goes up to your air gap. From your air gap, you have another hose that comes down and goes into your garbage disposal. So here you can see, just for demonstration purposes, you only really have two sources where the smell could be coming from. It could come from the line that's connected to your dishwasher and then runs to your air gap, or it could be the line that's running from your air gap to your garbage disposal, which is this rubber hose. So here we have a dishwasher that was removed. And if you look down here, you could see that the drain hose comes from the bottom of the dishwasher. Now if you look at this hose, if you see me play with it, you can see there's a lot of dirty water that's just stuck inside of there and that's going to be filled with uh, residue food deposits from your dishwasher that's shooting out the water into the air gap. Now, this is the bottom of your dishwasher and you'll see here when I grab the line, a lot of nasty water with food will come out. And so that's what is inside of your dishwasher line. And what happens oftentimes is when the person installs a dishwasher, they don't install it from the dishwasher shooting straight up. What they'll do is they'll let the dishwasher lay on the bottom and all of that food, that debris that's in the line will sit there and over time will start to rot. And then that's when you get a call, hey, I have a nasty sewer smell. And it's going to be because of a bad install on the dishwasher line. You can easily fix that, but I would recommend at that point just replacing the dishwasher line. It will look something like this. And you can see if it's laying flat like that, all of the buildup is just going to sit there over time and rot out. So you want to make sure that you fix your dishwasher line and I recommend at that point just replacing it. Here you can see the difference in the comparison between a new line and an old line. The second issue is going to be your hose that runs from your air gap to your garbage disposal. So you have your dishwasher, the drain line is connected to your air gap, and then the air gap connects to your dishwasher. And what that does is, whenever you're using your dishwasher, it'll basically shoot the dirty water into your garbage disposal. What often happens is when you remove the line from the air gap to your garbage disposal, when you look inside, you'll see there's just a lot of rot and buildup you see this one's just completely contaminated. Oftentimes it'll even be stuck inside the hose. And what you want to do is, you can clean it if you choose to, but I'd rather choose just to replace it and just put a brand new line um, to your garbage disposal. If you address those two issues, then you'll find that the smell that you're having will be eliminated. If this video was a help or informational, please subscribe.